Uh, it's, it's usually just something we do throughout the whole practice, but we'll, we'll start off with like a tackling circuit against the offense, and then they're trying to they're trying to challenge us as, as running backs and receivers and tight ends to make us miss, and we're challenging them to try to run us over if they can. So you know, sometimes in tackling, maybe you're just practicing fundamentals. Is this, is this one of those where you know Kirby's right up in there and the coach is right up in there, kind of egging you guys on to get more physical? Oh yes, sir, yes, sir. But we're always we're always coaching fundamentals. But it, it, it turns into like a challenge in a game to see who can who can beat who across the line. As you look back at the film from this last game, did you see that? Did you got, do you see you guys imposing your will a little bit more? I saw a little bit more edginess with us. From uh, we had a, a great Tuesday practice and a great Wednesday practice, and, and that showed on the field on Sunday. You hear sometimes in, in film whether it's you know they give out the hard hat or like the hit of the week things like that you guys do anything like that recognize the guys that are really making those plays. Uh, we don't, but I mean we, we let them know when they when they get off the field on the sideline. How's having a short shorter week? Uh, um, maybe is it just playing this Vanderbilt offense? Is it tougher to prepare for that having a short week? I don't I don't think it's as tough since we're, we're playing against the offense. It's somewhat similar to ours, but. Mondays are usually like a tune-up day, and then like it's personnel, and then we're back on schedule right now in terms of two days in practice. Your schedule change at all with this short week? Not at all. Besides the Monday practice. Okay. What do you mean besides the Monday practice? Uh, it was just a little bit shorter because we just went on Sunday, so we just we're trying to break down the lactic acid. We run, ran around a little bit and then did a little walkthrough. Chicks, what kind of leaders are Sony and Nick? <laughs> Uh, they're more of like, they're not, they're, they're vocal leaders, but they like to lead with their actions. So they like to make the big runs and, and, and big plays and, and then get the, the sideline hype with, with stuff like that. I was about to say, you know, especially in this last game, when Nick was carrying a whole bunch of people behind him for like 20 extra yards. Does that like fire you guys up? Yeah, that, that made me want to go out there and block for him if I could.